photocritic editor. She makes the Mumbai afternoons. Our signing star, Miss Priti Zinta, charmed her way into our hearts. Miss Priti, you are so pretty that I am pretty sure that you captivate the hundred hearts just by blessing that pretty smile of yours. And I can already hear a few heart. His charismatic charm and dynamic performances made him a runaway success and had ladies swooning at his very appearance. John, up to the business. Your profilta has brought charm and efficiency in your ministry and airlines too. I hope that young, smart and charming people like you are appointed in all the departments that bring Prasannata. We are very fortunate to have you as our world chairman. You, Munira and now Saina are all of <laughs> Next of liters of rainwater harvesting was done and many medical checkup camps were organized. Fees for education to needy and deserving students and help to the differently able were also given. I have received circulars from so many groups and also from families. I would request Lalita Vasan to please felicitate Nana Chudasama for doing and helping us in all these projects and showers, guiders. Many more years. May I request Mrs. Lalita Vasan to kindly hand over. Ladies and gentlemen, giants have present a potted plant to Mr. Kiran Shantaram, former sheriff of Mumbai and an ardent supporter of Giants International. Potted plant uh, to Mr. Agarwal, who represents Raymond's here. Raymond's have always been there for us, supported our ventures. So we'd like to uh, show our gratitude and appreciation for Raymond's by presenting Mr. Agarwal from Raymond's potted plant. May I request Insia Sewala, editor of Giants International Newsletter, to do the honors and felicitate Mr. Ratan Keswani, Executive Vice President. <laughs> May I request Mr. Joseph Katlariwala, Secretary of Appreciation of a wholehearted support to all our projects. No, we have Mr. Glenn Kaiser, Chief of Visas, American Consulate, who we would also dream, who fights the unbeaten for, who writes the unrightable wrong, and who runs where the brave dare not go. He is a man of conviction and courage, driven by principles, guided by nobility of purpose, and known for being on social and charitable organizations. He is also champion of business practice, disaster management, and relief and rehabilitation for his immeasurable contribution to the Foundation National Award 2006, which will be presented at the guiding spirit and world chairman of Giants International, Mr. Nana. Our chief guest, our chief guest from USA, Mr. Nitin Gadkari. Super highway, but surprisingly, it only ended till his house was there. <laughs> it was a great achievement, and all of you, I'm so glad. We are very fortunate, you know. We are living in an era when there are a lot of festivals, so that you don't ask, argue with him. So he was, I was so nervous when he did not turn up. I said, My God, not another minister. 
because you know it can be very infectious to have outstanding work as a minister of aviation. He is accessible. I like to tell our our aviation minister one little story. <laughs> so, so they asked me. So I said, as far as John Abraham is concerned, one of the reasons <laughs> she has courage to stand up for anything that is right. <laughs> so anyway. Talking about this, because after his movie, the sale of motorcycles are gone. <laughs> and I want you all to support. We get a lot of support, unbelievable support. Thing with as far as girl child is concerned, same thing. So when it comes to donations, people wonder how do you all raise this money? We don't have to raise. <laughs> I, I want to. I want to make it very clear that this is no indirect hint to <laughs> because that is not the reason. I am just saying that people do it. Recently, somebody in this country, and this is the only organization which is organized. Today, when it comes to corruption, I, I can say with real little shame that every. <laughs> Once again, just thank Nana in particular for having given me this award. I want to thank him because to me he represents what one individual can do to change society. Most of us as individuals actually don't believe that we can change or that we can make a difference. But Nana stands out as a classic example of someone who has made a difference. And he reminds me of what a British parliament... Ladies and gentlemen, here's Queen Isabel. Thank you, Good evening, everyone. Um, thank you, Mr. Chirasama. That's very nice of you. Uh, I'd like to thank Giants International. 
International. Um, I'd like to wish a good evening to everyone here. I'd also like to uh, say that of all the roles I've played, the role I enjoy the most and I feel most proud of is the role of a citizen of this country. And uh, since everyone has said such profound things, I just try to keep it simple. Um, I'll tell you a joke, actually. There was a man who used to pray very, very, very seriously to God every day and said, God, please, I want to win the lottery. I want to win the lottery. I want to win the lottery. And it went on every day, month, one year, two years, three years, five years. And one fine day, God suddenly just appeared, ran, and looked at him and gave him one slap. And he said, Okay, you'll win the lottery, but please, at least buy the lottery ticket. <laughs> so the point being, the moral of the story being that we can all pray to God and wish for better things for our society, but we all have to make an effort, even if it's a very, very small effort. And uh, please excuse me, everyone. I have a shoot which is waiting on the street, so I will have to excuse myself. So thank you very much and have a good evening. Thank you. Well, thank you, Preeti. We will have to say Alvida for now.